This is me at one of the biggest fitness expos in the world showing off my massive arms. But these aren't my real arms. These are. Growing up, I've always had small arms, and to this day, it's still one of my biggest insecurities. I was recently invited to the LA Fit Expo, and not only will a ton of my subscribers be there, but so will all the legends who I look up to in the fitness world. And I have never felt more pressure to look big than right now. With the Fit Expo only two weeks away, I had to figure something out. I was running out of options, but then it hit me. SpongeBob Anchor Arm. As a kid, this was my favorite episode of Spongebob, where he buys fake arms with inflatable muscles and shows them off to everyone around him. I have always wanted to try out a pair of them myself, but the only issue is, they don't exist. So, I'm gonna build them myself. I met up with my friend Jeremy, who's an expert engineer, to help me bring the anchor arms to life. We first had to figure out how to create a realistic outer layer for the arms, and we landed on using a silicone muscle suit. We could just cut off the body part, just yep. use the arms, yep. and then attach some sort of inflatable system to that. Only thing is this is like $600. <laughs> it's gonna be a little expensive, but I think this is probably our best option right here. We ordered the suit, and now we had to figure out how we were going to get these arms to inflate. And by we, I mean Jeremy. So. What we got here is our air compressor at 30 PSI. It will come up through two air hoses under your bodysuit and through the inflatables. Starting at 18 inches, hopefully we can go up to 25. Underneath the bodysuit, we're making our own inflatables specific to you. So that's what we're gonna try. Yeah, so I mean, it's basically what I wrote too, just a little bit more advanced. It's been about a week. Did all the parts come in on time or no? All the parts came in, bro. So this is the one we've been waiting for. Is this the muscle suit? This is the suit. Okay. Are you ready for this? Yeah. Pull this thing out. Oh my gosh. Whoa, this feels weird. Oh, it's it's strange, man. Look at that detail right there. It's crazy. I'm kind of afraid of like suffocating this thing. <laughs> it's gonna be tight. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There we go. Ah. <laughs> All right. Oh my god. Whoa. Wait, that looks pretty good. They need to be shaped a bit more, yeah. which is perfect because the anchor arms, they are just sleeves at first and then they pump up and really fill their shape. We have the perfect base for the anchor arms and now it was time for the most challenging part, building out the inflatable system. Step one, we need a clean working space. Okay. Um, it's not exactly what I meant. All right, man. Let's get these arms so we actually only have four days left to the fit expo so we do gotta move quick and get a lot done so while jeremy finished sewing i got to work on creating the dial on the original anchor arms there's a gauge that shows the pump level of the arms i replicated the design and then 3d printed a mini anchor to match the needle from the episode so i got the anchor right here i'm gonna put it in the dial should hopefully be able to make it in time as long as there's no issues i'm sure we can build it but will it actually work in the end who knows got all the things i need for this dial First, we're gonna take Zacto knife right here. Jeremy said these dials are very sensitive, so I'm trying to do this carefully. Dial's complete. Does it go to jerk? Come on. Perfect. Next, I worked on smoothing out the tube connectors so that they don't pop the inflatables. Jeremy now had everything he needed to complete the inflatable system. Today is try-on day. All right, let's put the right arm in. Are you ready to take your blood pressure? Uh-huh. <laughs> Insta-pump. The right arm is going, the left one isn't right now. Oh, I see. One of the air tubes is pinched, so we just gotta okay. shuffle it around so it doesn't pinch it when we're trying to inflate. Take number two. Now it's Feeling working. it? Yep. Oh, yeah. Our next step was to fully cut off the arms from the suit. Bada boom, bada bang. <laughs> All right, well, <laughs> seeing this on a fashion runway, I think it's gonna happen eventually. We now have our sleeves, we have the inflatables, we just gotta put it together. No, it's not perfect, but let me know. It's inflating. Oh, it's, it's growing. Definitely inflating. How about the forearm? I don't feel the forearm. Yeah, we're gonna have to uh, play with that surgical tube. I think that might be an issue where it's it's collapsing it. It'll just take a hot minute to uh, replace the connections. Yeah, we could do that for the rest of the day, and then tomorrow is our final day, and hopefully it all with those changes, it should work. Yeah. While Jeremy got to work on fixing the tubes, I headed to the store to buy clothes that would fit my new arms. I'm gonna have to put on the arm to make sure that the sweater fits over it. I look so weird in the middle of the store doing this. This is the biggest size they have. Hope this was gonna work. Huh. See, the arm isn't fully on. It is wide enough for it to fit. This one works. Thank you. I'm about to head over to Jeremy's and I am really hoping all we have to do today is just test the arms and maybe add some of the final touches. 
because to be honest, that's all we really have time for. I was able to get the manifold together to where we could uh, get the air compressor, get your quick release and the hand pump, and then we got our dial in there so you can see what level you're going to, and then also replace the surgical tubes with the clear tubes because it doesn't collapse like the surgical tube was under pressure. Okay, well let's go ahead and give it a try. This was the moment of truth. I'm over $2,000 deep into this project and our time was running out. The arms had to work. Let's see if we can go to normal. Okay. Uh, hearing some changes. Uh, did you see a difference in the arms? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's go to strong. Okay. There we go. We're on strong. We're on strong. They feel definitely bigger. <laughs> Going stronger? Fire. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It Let's go up to buff. See what we can do. All right. We're at buff. Okay. <sighs> definitely Feeling looks buff. bigger. <laughs> now let's see the final mode. Okay. Jerk. Let's go to jerk. Oh. My gosh. All right, that's jerk maxed and out. And we're at jerk maxed out. <laughs> Yo! Okay. It is noticeably bigger, and you can see my hands are turning blue. Yeah! <laughs> no way. It's I'm insane. just imagining myself in that fit expo <laughs> walking around like this. They are literally bigger than my legs right now. <laughs> All right, let's see the before and after of the arms inflating. Right. Ready? I'm ready. Let's Three, do this. Two, one. Oh, oh yes yes okay okay definitely can see the difference oh wow oh, look at that i mean that's that's gotta be a couple inches right oh there oh my gosh yeah the biggest thing for me and i think for everyone watching these have to inflate they have to be like the anchor arms in spongebob yep. and i think we have accomplished that here now there was just one last thing i needed to fully complete the arms anchor tattoos Beautiful. It's Fit Expo Day. Before I head inside, we need to go over the game plan. I feel like it sounds so much cooler when Ryan does it. Anyway, I have three objectives. Number one, make it as far as possible without anyone realizing that I'm wearing fake arms. Objective number two, get at least one girl to compliment my arms. I hope that happens. I really do. And objective number three, fully max out my arms to jerk mode by the end of the expo and complete three strength events without them popping. If I can complete all these objectives, I'll be satisfied with the $2,000 I spend on these arms. Let's do it. I have the anchor arms on. We're slowly gonna shed layers as the day goes on. Right now I'm heading up the stairs. I'm gonna meet with Chris Heria. He hasn't seen me in over a month. So we'll see if he notices any difference in my arms or my physique. Before I could get to Chris, a few of my subscribers are coming up to me and apparently they all think I'm massive in person because no one said a thing about my arms. It's probably just because of the jacket, but I'm gonna assume they think I'm massive. So far we're in the clear, but the real first test was Chris. Look at Oh, goddamn, bro. Dude, yeah, bro. I had to put on some size. Is this, is this for a f reason? What the f is this, dude? I'm, I'm filling out my frame. Goddamn. Dude, I've been, I've been bolting. Hey, but off, off camera, a doctor's been helping me out. I'm starting to like uh, go on like trend. <laughs> I can feel your tricep through like the 10 jackets you're f wearing, bro. I'm getting kind of hot. You want to help me take off the yeah, first yeah, I one? Yeah, I got you, bro. I got All right, you. All right, bet. What the f <laughs> This boy is roided out of his mind. All right, Chris figured that out pretty quickly, but that's okay, we tried our best. At this point, it's pretty clear that I'm wearing anchor arms, but no one has seen their full potential yet, and it was time to pump them up to normal and work on my next objective, get a compliment from a girl. Ladies, quick question, what do you rate my arms? They're not real. I'm here with my people. Gentlemen, I love the arms. Yeah, like like you, Rich Piana's eight-hour arm workout works wonders. You see, that's arm wrestling right over there. I'm gonna pump my arms to jerk mode, and we're gonna beat someone in arm wrestling. That's gonna be for the very end, though. I haven't even fully revealed my arms, and everyone was already staring. Woo! Yeah! Now that's bigger. Yeah. Yes, sir! Yeah. Give it a feel. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! All natural, baby. Oh, good to see you, brother. Good to see you, too. Well, I've been working hard. It's showing off. I think they're bigger than yours at this point, yeah? They are. Do you think they could be bigger? I think it could be. One second. All right. I got to pump up real quick. I'm going all the way to buff. Oh, it hurts. Gentlemen. Oh, my God. Good to see you, Martin. Good to see you. Yeah. It's been a minute. Holy what happened? I started hitting arms more. I'm inspired. You should walk with those. <laughs> Maybe I should enter World's Strongest Man now. Yeah, you should. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I got a little distracted, but back to my second objective. Excuse me. Can you rate my arms? Pardon? Can you rate my arms? No comment. No comment? No comment. Damn. Wow, those, those are really, really firm. 
I've been overtraining. What would you rate my arms? A there we go. I'm gonna take off the sweater and we're gonna have the anchor arms fully out. You see me? Yeah, yeah, sure. I actually was about to take off my sweater. Could you help me? Because I can't even take it off myself. Ugh. Woo! Let's go. God damn. Boom. <laughs> Anchors, baby! Now that my arms are fully revealed, I was drawing a lot of attention, especially from the ladies. Can I? Yeah, oh yeah, feel them. That's why I work on arms. I heard girls like big arms. Me too. Pretty slow, dog. If you want to see what my arms used to look like before Rich Piana's workout, oh, boom, that's wow. me. It's time to do some of these strength competitions. Let's see what these arms can do. There's a calisthenic section right here. I want to see if I can do at least one muscle up. Like, Okay, it works. Okay, that's it. Mission accomplished, I did a muscle up. My hands are starting to go numb and I have yet to pump all the way up to jerk mode. I'm considering calling it quits and just deflating them. I mean, they're already big enough as is and there's no way someone would say, Mine's still bigger though, bro. Oh. <laughs> he got them anchor arms. Oh I told you they were real. We're going all the way to jerk. We are fully maxed out right now. This hurts so much. I got the anchor arm plug. I got you if you need it. Oh yeah, deadlift. I don't know if the bar goes any lighter than that. I think you're forced to deadlift that amount. You're not gonna just curl this, are you? This is a deadlift competition, right? right? I'm not allowed. Come on. Let's go. Woo! Let's go. Okay, hold on. What's that? Hold on. Why is it so heavy? Okay, sorry guys. I'm a little embarrassed. I'm gonna go to arm wrestling. I think I'll have better luck. I see a guy wearing medals over there. I'm gonna ask if he wants to go against me. Are you a professional arm wrestler? I am, yeah. I think uh, we should pull. Let me feel you a little bit. Only someone who got first place is able to beat me. That's all I'm saying. I think my ego is starting to inflate along with my arms because I don't know what I was thinking challenging someone who placed at the top of an entire arm wrestling tournament. I'm going to need all the help I can get. So I'm inflating these bad boys all the way up to max jerk mode and I'm giving it my all. Three, two, one, go. Come on, arms. Oh my god. Oh. I don't think me losing here was a surprise to anyone. As cool as having big arms is, it's just not the same when the strength doesn't come along with it. I'm just gonna hit the gym more and build them up the right way.